Hey guys, this is going to be a quick video response for one of my subscribers, Packrat556. Chris posted up a video about a week or so ago showing his fire kit. I watched the video and commented on it. Chris replied to my comment and asked me if I could show him what I keep in my kit. So Chris, this is for you. I pretty much have the same container you have. It's a waterproof container. I'm leaving mine red because I want it to stand out as a fire kit in case anybody else opens my pack. It'll be easy for them to find. Inside, I keep a couple of tampons. These are fantastic fire starters. Now what you want to do is you want to take this little outer layer off. And once you have that layer off, you can then just start to pull the material apart. You want to fluff it up as much as possible because the smallest strike is going to ignite this thing. And I found that if you leave them bunched up together like this, they kind of burn really slow. This way, if you fluff it out, one little spark hits this thing, it goes up like mad. So those are fantastic fire starters. Like you, Chris, I keep petroleum-soaked cotton balls. I do have a magnesium fire starter. A fire steel and striker, just like you have. I also have a small disposable lighter. And I also have a small waterproof container with Strike Anywhere matches. Now, when I take this stuff with me, it's all in this kit. And I don't leave it there once I get to wherever I'm going. I break it up because a lot of people are going to say, if I lose this, I'm screwed. And you're absolutely right. This is just the way that I keep it in my pack to get wherever I'm going. I may put this in my vest or whatever I'm carrying. This may go in another pack or something like that. So if I have something on me at all times based on what pack I'm carrying or what I happen to be wearing, I'm never leaving leaving it all in just one container, all right? So that's pretty much it. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to let me know, and I appreciate all your support. Chris, I hope I answered your question. Take care, man. Bye.